One of the most popular features in LACERT tax software is your ability to keep track of the status of your clients in terms of where are the clients in your tax return preparation process. So let's take a look at how simple this is to do in LACERT tax. This is the LACERT client screen where you manage all of your client files, do all of your practice management. And if you look in the third column of your client screen, you have a column called status. This is where you keep track of the work in progress to know when clients are final or whether they're on extension, under review, or in progress. There are a number of different statuses you can use to keep track of your work. Now, how do you change a status once, once you want to move the client from one status to the next? So we have an example here of a return for John Jacobs. So what I do is I select John's return, which is currently in a status of under review. Top of the screen is a button that says client status. Simply click the button and it opens up what we call our status dialog. It lists on the bottom all of the statuses that you use and shows you the dates that you've changed the statuses. But above, you simply open the box and select final. Click OK. The return is now marked with a status of final. The other great thing about our status capability is you don't have to do it one at a time. You may have 5, 10, 20 returns that you'd like to change the statuses of all of those at one time. You can do that very easily in LACERT. And here's how. Let's say I want to change the Christopher return. I'd like to change the Jonas return. And I'd also like to uh, change the status for the return for Kevin Jones. I select the returns. I click the status button, but now it gives me an option that it doesn't do when I just select one. It says, would you like to apply the same status to all these clients or set a separate one? I'd like to apply the same to all of these returns, and I'd like to mark these returns with a status of final. Click OK. The returns are now changed to a status of final. So it's very simple to do it. Now, on the left-hand side of our, of our client screen, we also have this area called a filter. And you see one of our filters is client status. So if you are at the, maybe you're at the beginning of April, and you'd like to know every client that currently has a status of under review, you know you need to complete those returns, you simply go to the filter for client status, open it, and click under review. It tells me I have five. Well, how many clients do I currently have that are final? Click on the left, final, and it looks like I've got 19. Under review, information pending, waiting for 8879. The great thing about the status capability in LACERT, beyond the fact that it's just really easy, is that you, your firm, decides what you're going to call the statuses. In LACERT, at the top of the screen under settings, we have an area here called options where you set all of your program preferences. And among the nine tabs that are running across the top of the box, there's one on the left that says status. So before you begin to use LACERT, you'll come in here. We give you the first five statuses in the list, and you can create up to 20 different statuses. But if you don't like the ones we give you, because you just like to call them different things, just double click on the name of the status. Maybe I want to change the word final to complete. Just ch make the change to complete. Okay, now when I click OK, all those returns that were previously marked as final are now marked as complete. So not only is it simple for you to do it, you can do multiple status changes at the same time and use the filtering to identify those clients. You also have the ability to go to Settings, Options, and to the Status tab to create the actual statuses that your firm uses. Thank you.